welcome gem enthusiasts to a journey through time adorned with a captivating allure of sapphires. Today we will unveil legendary sapphire jewels, each a dazzling testament to history and human artistry. Hi everyone, I'm Sasha Kareva and on this channel I talk about gemstones. Welcome to the Blue Bell of Asia. The saga of the Blue Bell of Asia a sapphire so magnificent it once held the title of most expensive in the world. The cushion cut stunner weighs a whopping almost uh, 400 carats and boasts a cornflower blue hue that leaves you breathless. It is found in Sri Lanka, discovered in 1926. This gem hails from the island nation famed Ratnapura district, known as the City of Gems. It was originally owned by famous gem and jewelry dealers who based in Colombo. Then uh, Lord Nuffield, the founder of Morris Motors, purchased it in 1937. The Blue Bell of Asia is one of the world's most legendary fires, and it earned the title of the most expensive blue sapphire once it was sold in Christie's Geneva in November 2014. The initial bid price of 7 million was elevated to the final realized. 70 million as it was sold to a private collector remains unidentified to this day. The cushion cut maximizes the gem's mesmerizing color and brilliance, playing with light to create a captivating dance of blue hues. Some whispers of the blue bell's mysterious powers, believing it brings good luck to its owner. Next famous sapphire is the Blue Giant of the Orient. It's a sapphire of staggering size and captivating mystery. This Colossal gem, when around 500 carats, its enigma shrouded in history and speculation. The blue giant is the largest faceted sapphire ever discovered. Where exactly this behemoth was unearthed remains a tantalizing mystery. Some rumors point to Sri Lanka, while others whisper of Kashmir. Despite its extraordinary size, the blue giant boasts a symmetrical cushion cut that maximizes its brilliance. This masterful craftsmanship reveals the depth and intensity of its deep blue hue, said to resemble to velvety night sky. Currently, the blue giant resides in a private collection hidden from public view. Its value is estimated to be in the tens of millions of dollars, but its true worth lies in its unique size, mesmerizing color and enigmatic history. So let the speculation continue and who knows, maybe one day the blue giant will revel its full history and shine even brighter in the world spotlight. The George VI Sapphire now is stepped into a world of dazzling jewels and royal history with the King George VI Sapphire suit. This breathtaking collection of necklace earrings is a captivating ode to love, family and tradition. In 1937, King George VI, known for his devotion to his wife Queen Elizabeth, presented her with this magnificent suit as a wedding anniversary gift. The sapphires were originally part of an antique diamond and sapphire necklace belonging to Princess Louise of Belgium. Queen Elizabeth II wore the necklace and earrings on numerous occasions, including state portraits and official engagements. In 2022, Queen Camilla, the Queen Consort, broke tradition by choosing the suit as her first coronation jewels. The suit features seven magnificent sapphires, each showcasing a deep, velvety blue hue. The central gem is a stunning 167-carat cabochon on sapphire, believed to be from Sri Lanka. Diamonds delicately frame the sapphires, adding a touch of sparkling brilliance to their set. The platinum setting creates a timeless and elegant foundation for the vibrant stones. The necklace can be converted into a tiara by adding a detachable diamond frame. Queen Elizabeth II wore the tiara most notably at the opening of the Canadian Parliament in 2015. The estimated value of the suit is in millions of pounds. With its captivating beauty and rich history, this jewel continues to capture our imagination and inspire wonder. 
next up fire is the star of india this magnificent gem weighing a hefty 563 carats nestled deep within the lush hills of sri lanka this precious sapphire first saw the light of day centuries ago its intense blue color and the mesmerizing six red stars that shimmers within made it an instant treasure legend has it that the gem once belonged to a sinhalese king and later ended up in the hands of a burmese monarch in 1716 king george III occurred the stone adding to the British crown jewels. The star of India has adorned several notable figures throughout history. The Queen Victoria wore the sapphires as a brooch during her coronation in 1837. The Duchess of Edinburgh in 1875 the stone was reset into a pendant for Queen Victoria's daughter-in-law. Then the American Museum of Natural History. In 1964, the sapphire was briefly stolen from the museum in a daring haste but thankfully recovered. The star of India is cut and cabochon, meaning it's polished smooth rather than faceted, allowing its natural beauty and play of light to shine through. Its intense blue color is attributed to the presence of trace amounts of iron and titanium in the gemstone. The six rayed star within the sapphire is a phenomenon called asterism caused by light reflected of tiny needle-like inclusion within the stone. Today the star of India sapphire resides in the Hall of Gems in the American Museum of Natural History in New York City. Next sapphire is the Logan sapphire, one more magnificent stone weighing a staggering 423 carats. Unlike most sapphires which boast a vibrant blue hue, the Logan sapphire takes almost black color in low light. But under the slightest movement or gleam of light, it explodes with steady flashes of deep blue and shimmering purple, like a miniature galaxy trapped within its depths. The Logan Sapphire's origins are shrouded in mystery. It's believed to have been mined in Sri Lanka sometime in the 19th century, but its exact history remains unclear. The first documented owner of the stone was John Logan, an American politician. After his death, the sapphire passed through several hands, eventually ending up in the private collection of Harry Winston, the legendary New York jeweler. In 1916, Winston donated the Logan Sapphire to the Smithsonian Institution, where it resides today as a crown jewel of the National Gem and Mineral Collection. Next will be the most interesting, Princess Diana Kate Middleton's engagement ring. This sparkler has graced the fingers of two beloved royals, Princess Diana and Kate Middleton, captivating the world with its timeless elegance and rich history. Originally chosen by Prince Charles for Princess Diana in 1981, the ring wasn't newly made for her. It was part of the Garrett Collection, a trove of antique jewels offered by renowned British jewelers. The ring features a 12 carat oval Ceylon sapphire, known for its deep, vibrant blue hue. This stunning stone is surrounded by 14 solitary diamonds, creating a halo effect and enhancing the sapphire's brilliance. This sapphire is set in in 18 karat white gold, adding a subtle brilliance to the overall design. After Princess Diana's tragic passing, the ring was inherited by Princess Harry in a touching gesture. Prince Harry later gave the ring to the Prince William to propose to Kate Middleton in 2010, carrying forward a piece of his mother's legacy. The ring embodies far more than just precious stones. It symbolizes enduring love, family ties, and enduring memory of Princess Diana. While the ring remains virtually unchanged, Kate Middleton has incorporated her own touches. She occasionally pairs it with her late mother in a low wedding band, creating a heartfelt dry boot and a unique combination. We understand that you might not have access to royal jewels or museum pieces, but that does not mean you cannot own a piece of sapphire magic. True Gems offers a stunning selection of sapphire. Don't hesitate to message us and we help you in your needs. We invite you to visit our website truestones.store and explore the world of gemstones. At True Gems, we believe in the magic of gemstones and the joy they bring. Let us help you find your own piece of history and brilliance. Thank you for watching. See you in the next videos.